Hello and welcome to RA Base Victorio Nellius. Uh, we're trying to get towards uh, distribution, logistic network, and then we'll uh, we'll start making a mini mall here. Yeah. So, wh how, where do you lean on? Uh, I'm I'm kind of going back and forth on yes trains, no trains. Um, I think I'm gonna end up trying to make a little bit of a bigger base up here, uh, going for trains uh, with oars, um, and yeah, actually going for a full network, I think. I think that would be worthwhile. Um, I need to figure out prioritization on the network. That's a big, big thing. Um, Let's see, you guys are doing okay. This is gonna pile back up. Mm. This is backlogging. Is it backlogging all the way here? It's not, so that's good. Because I'm pretty sure we're gonna use uh, quite a decent amount too. Um, let's see. Yeah, so you are a little bit short on stuff. Yeah, we're, we're just... We have you guys. You are the bottleneck of a lot of things right now. Also because you uh, you did this. Yeah, so I mean, I actually did a C block playthrough all the way without trains, which I think. So at the end, I had massive UPS issues, which is why I'm not not tempted to do that again. But it's. In general, I just like bots so much more than trains. Even like the visual, just the, the giant swarms flying around, and it's uh, it's just nice. It's uh, it's very. Um, I guess trains ha does have a similar effect, but it's it's yeah. Bo both are good, but I, I think we'll, we'll go for trains this time and uh, try to make that in a, a little bit of a proper way. Let's see, how are you? We're still way short on the iron here. I guess we're, we're still using a bunch here and that's it, basically. We ju just don't have a lot. Um... We could try and expand this a little bit more, but... Oh, we're low power. Okay, that's something we can fix. Let's, uh, let's try and do that. Uh, and I also wanted to visit probably this guy, yeah. This is what we wanted to fix as well. Okay. Uh, low power, so if we look at this... Yeah, it might be a fluid issue, right? So we could try to add some extra seawater in. Yeah, if, or we could upgrade this to level two pipe. That might also help, right? Um, though it doesn't look like they're at max capacity. Yeah, so if I'm gonna go for trains, I actually do think I'm gonna go for one twos because they, um, they fill up a little bit faster, right? Or rather, well, yeah, you you get, like if you have a small production facility, you get a full train faster. So you have less uh, issues waiting for stuff. Um, but also because of the swarm of trains, that's, that's gonna be quite fun. Yeah. Let's see. You guys are doing all fine. In fact, we're a little bit, well, we're not low on the ore per se. We just were bottlenecked on the, the belt, more or less. That's fine. Mm. So what else do we need to prepare? I don't think that much more. So we can kind of soonish going to try and start 
we'll, we'll want to make some uh, some more uh, of you guys and just uh, enter these so we'll limit you to 50 um, let's see same for you guys uh, yeah we'll also want to remove that remove this limit you that's 250 here as well uh, we have you we can do you and limit you to um, mm, plastic less than 100. I don't want to do big ass backlogs because we don't really know where we're going quite yet. Um, I mean, we could do it as well. Um, let's limit you though. Let's do the same. Okay. So. And we should have. Yeah, these guys here. So we're also gonna split those off. Um, and we don't have any steel anymore. So let's uh, factor that in. Actually. I shouldn't be using normal ones anymore if I can help it. So let's see if we can uh, steal some of the higher level ones. They're made up here. Huh? So are we going to be able to do that? Looks like we are. Excellent. Excellent. Mm, yeah, we'll eat this. Um, we'll just make a little bit of an interceptor here. Yeah, so we'll want normal ones. Uh, sure, let's ask for a stack. Same for you. Uh, let's see if we can. Oops, if we can manage that. Uh, so we'll do this. And limit you on that. Let's do uh, 10. Oh, there we go. Supply by logistic robots. Um, yeah, it's going to be slow as molasses for a while. That I always keep forgetting that. But we do want... So I'm, I'm building this for eventual consistency. We'll use a buffer chest, hopefully, or I guess a requester chest at first to make sure that we uh, get whatever we want. Um, yeah, that seems like where we want to be. Uh, splitter, same thing. So we'll build you. We don't have any more. That's fine. Let's craft a couple more. There we go. I still do have poles. Let's copy this, but except you, we want to do you. Well, that's going to work out, except when I walk out of the area, it's going to be immediately problematic, but that's fine. Or just... Uh, using uh, and abusing the system a little bit mm. yeah so the main thing i would need to prepare for trains is that i um i need an overflow strategy and so I'm going to steal some some blueprints from a playthrough I did with friends. Um, so we can I think we can go two ways on this. We can go either with a global circuitry network, which I think the idea is that you uh, signal. So so you just build everything normally 
but then you have a an, an overflow station where you signal if there's too much of something or i guess we don't need no we don't need so so provider stations should always signal and then we have special overflow stations that only activate if um that only activate if there's too much of something on that uh, global network. That's, I think, where you want to be. Um, but I don't really know if that will work out. Let's see. Oh, this also looks like where we want to be. Large miners. Yeah, we're gonna as much as possible try to upgrade to stuff that we um, like maybe can't quite afford yet but that's okay we want to do st some stuff that's very much future proof and we'll just it's okay if it takes a little bit for it to be built uh, we're gonna set up a robot network and uh, make some construction bots as well and then We'll, we'll make it work that way. Mm, so this is coming along the way. Yeah, it stacks quite nicely. So that's all good. This is going to consume a little bit. But that's fine. Our power troubles. Yeah, we're right on edge. I, th I actually did grab some of these to, uh, to make some heat pipe. Which I uh, guess I should be doing. Okay, let's just put down a couple of storage chests to make sure that we don't mess stuff up. And then we have the heat pipes over here. So for now, we can't do the requester chest quite yet, but we can do this guy. So we'll do you, you and actually we'll do you and limit you to uh, 10 um, and then we'll request stuff I guess we'll just request a stack of them is that m a bit much maybe uh, and we'll also need you guys I guess Yeah, okay. Uh, a lot of heat pipe coming up. Uh, the bolts are just slow, but that's fine. And we need to empty you out. And in order to make this, we need more heat pipe. Well, I guess it's gonna come from these guys. They're so slow. But that's okay. I, I guess we should be doing a little bit about... Um, yeah, about the buffer. Yeah, I agree. I, I so, so you clearly see that even though like in in vanilla some of that stuff doesn't make sense or or just complicates the recipes too much and the fact that you they've used the design space in the in sort of in the mod pack space right to you want if you want more complex recipes and you want to use the lower tiers that's actually um i think that's a really nice move because it it's yeah, it exactly does uh, does work the way you want it to. Um, let's see. Do we want more of these, or do we? We probably actually want to fix up the. Let's let's actually. Should I do a construction bot thing? Yeah, we can only craft construction bots once we have the distribution setup huh? um 
Yeah, so if I walk out of the network, everyone and their mother is going to the storage chest to put their stuff in and then pick it back up to bring it to me, but that's fine. Yeah, no, I, I, I see what you mean, especially so, so if you look at it uh, sort of from a, from a realism point of view, it, it doesn't make sense. Right. Which, which I think this mod pack has a, a especially chemistry wise, uh, as a real nice, realistic view of the world. But if you, I, from a realism point of view, it sort of makes sense that a, a miner that works on a totally different axis than another one can't be used to make that other one. But just from a gameplay perspective, I think it's a very nice quality of life upgrade. And it also enables stuff that you can just destroy the whole thing. Like you can just clean up stuff and use the things you've built to upgrade them into things that are more relevant, which I think is a very nice uh, feature indeed. Let's see, we want some more, um, I guess some more solar collectors, right? Or, or yeah, or we also want to, let's um, also do this. So we're gonna upgrade um, the pipe. So you know, from you to you and from you to you. Uh, let's do that over here. Okay, we're gonna need a lot of underground pipe, so we'll have to uh, we'll have to craft that. Um, can we make that? We need gravel for it. I'm pretty sure we have a bunch of that right here. Excellent. And then the only thing is that I have random stuff left over so let's just eat some of that you whatever dude, this is fine um yeah okay let's queue all of that okay that apparently we can't do that oh that's cool if you Cancel the prerequisites. Yeah, I guess that makes sense. You only cancel the stuff that you actually don't need. Okay. Um, this guy makes two. We do need to queue a little bit more. Yeah, and then we'll bring some of our own. Uh, let's replace you by a fast one. Okay, let's uh, vent that hydroxide and then uh, upgrade all of this. But these are seawater intakes and oh uh, yeah, this is out of flow. Um, for a second, I thought I dumped my robots, but no such thing. <clears throat> Let's see. We probably will need a couple more of you as well. Let's craft those. We're a little bit late to the party on that. Okay, we're gonna squeak through here, hopefully. Yep, we can. Just make sure that we've got everything. There we go. And keep upgrading this. The water is probably the primary issue, but it might also be the heat. So we probably wanna add some solar collectors as well. 
that this has just been something that's been been coming for a while. There we go. Then make sure we grab these guys. Maybe I should handcraft a couple more robots. So repair pack. We need steel for that. Okay, so if I grab some steel, I can make repair packs. Let's do that then. Yeah, good stuff. Um, before moving on, let's cut this episode right here. Thank you for watching and I'll see you next time. If you enjoyed this video, please consider liking and subscribing. It helps people like you find it too. Thanks.